Hi, I'm Paweł Spechalski and when two months ago, actually almost two months ago, I tried to directly compare INAV with Betaflight and Imuflight, I was not that much impressed with the performance of the Imuflight. Something was not right. A lot of noise was getting through the, through the filters, it was in a state of constant oscillation, it was controllable, but comparing to the Betaflight or even INAV Imuflight definitely lacked quite a lot of the performance. Luckily, Sometimes passed and uh, we have a new unofficial versions of the Emo flight with new features, with fixed Kalman filter, with my implementation of the gyro matrix filters and some on the new, improved, hopefully improved uh, features and, um, and just improvements. So I think it's time to give Imuflight uh, another chance. I have Imuflight 0.2.50, I think. I, why, guys, why haven't you finally released 3.0 as an official release? Please, guys, Imuflight, do it. I have it flashed on complete defaults, nothing, no tuning, no checking. I'm in my favorite f flying space and let's give it a try. Okay, guys from Imoflight definitely improved something because something that I noticed last time, the constant oscillation and the flutter of the propellers is definitely gone. The filters, even on the absolutely default settings, are behaving at least nicely. There is no visible oscillations. And uh, let me try the punch out. Okay. No vibrations on the punch out as well, so that's really nice. And definitely the PIDs are not too low. The quad feels actually very controllable in flight. I would have to say it really performs amazingly. Really, guys, I have no idea what you did. Is it the matrix filter or finally the the Kalman filter is behaving like it's supposed to be behaving, but this thing flies great. Really, honestly, super controllable in flight. Everything is great. Everything is fantastic. Motor sounds great. Nothing vibrates. I have to say that really, honestly, I'm impressed. The only downsides, but it's not really downsides of the Imuflight at the moment is the fact that I cannot show you the HD... Ah! Oh, oh, I fit! I cannot show you the HD footage of the flight because the frame I'm using right now... I cannot really mount my GoPro on it. Um, the Tempest frame is great and I know that there is a way to install GoPro session on it, but I have no session. I have only full GoPro 7 and 8 and unfortunately this thing just does not fit on the Tempest because wow really really super I know the term locked in is used too often but this thing is locked in I would have to even say that this thing flies <laughs> Better than INAF 2.5? <laughs> Maybe not better, but actually very, very, very close what INAF 2.5 and me are preparing for the next release. It's hard to me... But this, okay. Maybe the prop wash was not that great over here. It's really great. I cannot compare right now with the Betaflight 4.2 because I not... I haven't tested this thing yet, but definitely I have to sit on INAV and improve how INAV, well, how INAV performs on default. The difference is very subtle, I have to say. I was flying with INAV on the same very quad and exactly the same propellers yesterday. I, it's really hard for me to say if it flies better or worse. Um, I would have to say it really, really, really flies behave. And if I was given just an example of how Emo Flight 
50 or INAF 2.5 flies, I would not be able to distinguish one from the other. Like with the previous release of Emu, just the amount of vibration was killing everything. Here with 0 0.250, it's really, really, really great. I think I actually wanted to fly only two lipos on the squad with flushed with emu but i think i will fly more it's really super nice super agile well this is a racer this is really a full breed racer i was using like uh, in the series two years ago uh, and it's super light and very agile and maybe not over powerful but powerful enough <laughs> no this is this is amazing really this is this is great this is great i i, I really have to check how Kalman filter will work with IDAV because this is this is something else this is super 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 cool okay I think it's time to land now so the flight test is over and I have to say I'm very 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 positively surprised with the latest Emo flight not official guys please make this thing official this thing flies great um the emu team definitely did the lesson did the homework and uh, it's fantastic honestly it's fantastic i love how this thing handles my my quad without any problems no vibration no oscillation controllable prop wash although the propellers are like two generations old and the prop wash was never very good on them great 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 job what's is it one feature that made emu flight that well at least for me and on the squad probably not probably they finally finally fixed the Kalman filter and uh, improved another filters and there's a my matrix filter and there are really dozens of hours of development work that I'm sure went into the latest Emo flight and the result is fantastic honestly honestly fantastic it, uh, it's been a while since I was that positively surprised by anything this is this, this is this is honestly this is the best positive surprise I had in like last month probably great fantastic I'm this is the guy that usually is the grumpy and sees on sees only a downsize of things it's fantastic it's fantastic it's fantastic better flight you have a competition I know yeah definitely I know also have a comp has a competition now because for me if I would have to compare right now how latest Emu flight and latest Aina fly on the falls, I would definitely not be able to choose the, the one that flies better, very simple, because they are really very, very, very close right now and uh, not much worse, maybe even better. Oh, okay, okay. The next round of comparison between the major three or maybe four flight controller software in a few months, not right now, so far. Yeah, this thing yeah, this thing definitely is something right now. Okay, so thank you for watching. Yeah, until the next one. Bye bye.